Hey you guys, um, I just wanted to come on and tell you about some of the things I've got at Target, Kirkland's, and Cracker Barrel. I'm super excited because Cracker Barrel started to put their stuff on. I just love Cracker Barrel's like Christmas packaging, Christmas specials, Christmas stuff that they have in their little gift shop. Like I love the holiday stuff Cracker Barrel does, especially Christmas. They just definitely like top it off. Um, and I do have my little fluffy black and red Santa hat. Um, I'm kind of a Georgia fan, but you know, I just thought it was cute because it wasn't like a normal Santa hat. But I probably look a little crazy. I worked before I went to work, and then I went to work and worked, <laughs> and worked and worked and worked. And then my mom and I went around, um, 8.30 and went to go get tickets for this winter train ride that we ended up having to stand in line for a good four hours in below freezing weather so it's about one o'clock now and I'm still freezing and I'm just I just had to come talk to you guys so um I'm gonna start off with what I got at Target um I did get some holiday food items just some, some of them are little like gift stocking stuffers and some of them are just like holiday special things. I'll go ahead and talk about the uh, sugar cookie toast crunch first. I love this stuff. It straight up tastes like a sugar cookie like no other. And um, it's great. I had it for breakfast this morning. It's awesome. Like I wish this was year round because it does taste like sugar cookie dough like it's not just a big sugar cookie it's like sugar cookie dough um another great thing i don't have a box of it with me um but during the holiday season celestial tea does make a sleigh bell sugar cookie like flavored tea it tastes exactly like sugar cookies but it's a herbal natural tea it's caffeine free and i mean it tastes amazing if you can get your hands on it this holiday season before they like aren't in season anymore and stop carrying it in store. It's amazing. Year round you can still get it on Celestial Tea's website. And um, I'm just making sure that that was the website. But um, it's really great. Like I put, I don't even, I do put sugar in mine. Usually I put honey in my herbal tea. But the sugar cookie one you just have to have with a little bit of sugar. It's already pretty sweet but just a little takes it over the top. It's great. Um, but yeah, this cereal is awesome too. And then we did pick up a big thing of like the poppycock cashew lovers for my dad. He's super into this stuff, so that was really awesome. It was on sale. Um, and then I know these have been going around YouTube a lot, but this is like my second or third bag in probably as many weeks. But it is the dark chocolate covered wavy lays. If you, I mean, these are definitely, like, the period food. Like, you need these. Even if you're not a dark chocolate fan, like, there's something about them that it's just so easy to eat. The whole bag of them. But these are really great. Um, they're not the cheapest thing in the world, but like I said, like, it's totally worth it. They're amazing. And, yeah, you could make your own, but, like, this is so much easier. So, <laughs> these are awesome. I'm definitely in love um, if you're out and you see these, you definitely have to pick up a bag just to try it because you will not be disappointed. Um, and then if you go to any, like, I know here in Georgia, if you go to any sporting events, they always have these, like, sugared almonds or something, and you get, like, a little bag for, like, five dollars or, I mean, like, a little, like, cone, like, paper cone filled of these things, um, for, like, five dollars, but, uh, I've been... My whole family like hunts and hunts these things, and finally we found some that are pretty close. They're the Archer Farms Honey and Cinnamon Almonds, and these are just like amazing. Like they taste exactly. If you've ever had these, you know what I'm talking about. These are them. They taste exactly like it. Um, I haven't experimented with like heating them up because usually you get those heated up, but I'm definitely gonna do that. And then of course we do have um, one of my favorite foods for the holiday season and my whole family's favorite food. 
but it is the chocolate covered cherries and it is the 100% liquid center. They do have some that have a nougat center and they're just not as good. The nougat kind of throws it off, but these are really good. The chocolate around them is a really good chocolate. Um, so I like this brand that Sela's or Sela's or Kel I don't know. It's got to throw with a C. I don't know. And then of course, if you haven't tried these yet, you've got to pick up a box if you find it. Um, it is the Ginger Family, and they're just such a good cookie. It's such a light gingerbread taste, but it still is kind of there. Um, but I love these. It's like a Christmas tradition. Like this is probably our only Christmas tradition is having 900 boxes of these cookies. They're amazing. Just pour yourself a big old glass of milk. You're good to go. Um, and then on to Kirkland's, or well, I still got stuff from Target. Whoops. My friend is like is super in love with Phloxes. So I found this Phlox gift bag and um, I thought it'd be really great because we keep going by this thing that she just loves. And I'm only going to play this for a second because I don't know the copyright like issues or whatever, but it does say the song like What Would the Phlox Say? What does the Phlox say? <laughs> so there's that. It's really cute. It was like 13 bucks. Um, I know, I'm not sure when it ends, but Target's doing a $10 or 15 I think, I don't know, code, I can't remember what it is, for so much off your purses, purchase off $50 of holiday stuff. So there is that. Um, and then looking around in there, I did find her a little, like, fox snow globe, and it's gonna look all cozy see you can kind of tell it's super cute it has the year she's kind of into snow globes it's a box I thought it was perfect um we usually she and I usually do each other a pretty big like little a pretty good sized gift and then like a stocking full of stocking stuffers so um I did the only I'll go ahead and mention this the only literally the only thing I got at Kirkland's was this sachet and this thing smells amazing but it has a fox on it and I thought I'd include it as a stocking stuffer she can stick this in her purse in one of her drawers etc etc so many options for these things underneath the car in your seat your center console literally so many options to get in your closet um, and this smells amazing and I think that uh the oh it even says on here closets autos gift baskets trash cans vacuum bags bathrooms um etc 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 but i think the scent is foxy it smells amazing it smells like a it smells like if you ever used the self tanner Lindsay lohan sort of helped do it was like called seven nine and it was spelled all crazy that was literally the best self tanner and the best smelling self tanner in the whole entire world they don't make it anymore, but if you use it, this is what this smells like. It's amazing. And I'll go ahead and read to you, like I said, the scent is foxy, and it says, The vibrant freshness of ginger, peach, and orchid blended with tea rose and a deep woody base. And, I mean, I know it sounds crazy, but it definitely, that's what it smells like. There's some rose. It's kind of got a spicy ginger scent, um, and then it's kind of got a woodsy kind of scent to it, too. So it definitely could be even used almost all year round scent to me. Like it's definitely a heavier winter scent, but at the same time it's lighter too. I don't know. It's very strange, complex. I was like walking around my room and I was like, what smells amazing? It was this. <laughs> and I will show you, um, I've been invited to my guys like family thing that he does. Um, and I just feel like it's a good, you know, sends a good impression if I bring a gift and his parents are at, at his grandma's house so of course I'm going to get something for her and then his parents are going to be there so I'm going to get something for them. Um, I found this peace, joy, love, happy holidays. You know it's it's a little maybe too much um, sentiment for us I guess. Not necessarily like we're not serious but we're not not serious. It's an, it's an odd time okay. And um, I thought this was a really nice plain bag. I'm going to do some white tissue paper because it's got the white love and 
nothing else that's white so I thought the white would be pretty or like a cream tissue um, and then all I'm gonna do I'll go ahead and move on yeah I'll go ahead and move on and show you some of the Target stuff I did get these bags like I said these came from Target but what I'm gonna put in them is one of the Yankee Candle uh, Candy Cane Cottage and this is a mixture of peppermint bark and red velvet. It smells very similar to Candy Cane Lane with less peppermint and more sweet. But not necessarily a white chocolate scent. You definitely smell some red velvet. But um, it smells really, really amazing. Pretty light. And these were 25% off at Cracker Barrel. So that's really nice because it's not, not that I want to spend a lot on his people but I'm you know young I have a job and I have other people to buy for so there's that um and I just I'm gonna put that in one of the bags and I mean it already looks you know perfect great and then I, there's enough room for me to fit one other item so I'm gonna pick up a bag um I know right now Kroger has them two for five they are the gold bag of the lint truffles that have the white the dark and the milk chocolate um, I figured that'd be something, the candle's long-lasting, and the chocolate is something they can eat and have, and it'll be great. So, and do for five, that's not bad, and then I have one to put in each bag, and I'm done. So, that's an easy hostess gift if you've got somewhere to go. Like I said, 25% off Yankee Candle while it's still, like, in season is pretty good, but you gotta go and see what they have because they're going fast. So, there's that, and I did get two of these. The other one is in here. And then... We got my dad something. He and I went to Cracker Barrel the other day, and he was like, if you wanted to get me something for Christmas, that would be it. So we figured we had to get it. Um, and it is the Pennzoil Motor Oil, like, huge mug. And he said that this is the size that they used to be when they came. Like, the, the yeah, the quart, get the quartz or whatever. And it is 32 fluid ounces. You could literally fit, like, a whole, this is your all day drink, your all day coffee right here. And it, we just got the Pennzoil one. I know this is one he said he liked. They have four different ones. Gulf, Pennzoil, Texaco, and I'm blanking. But, um, so if your dad's kind of like in a lot of motive, they have a lot of really, really great stuff at a good price. This was $15, and that's really good for this mug. And I bought him a big mug last year that was a Hershey's mug. And the handle started to crack, um, a few uses in and this just seems like a much more reinforced handle so from a quality standpoint if you have this filled all the way up I feel like it's going to be fine of course you might even want to say something and just say hey you don't have to fill it the 32 ounces but you know um and then we just got a couple little stocking stuffers he loves my dad loves fudge so we got him some fudge and then, of course, um, these were, like, some candy that came out, like, in the 90s. Actually, they got repopularized in the 90s. And, because I think they had, like, some Nickelodeon, like, splat packaging or something crazy. And this is super sentimental to me and my brother. So I just figured I'd pick him up some of that to put in his stocking. Um, and then the last thing I got was something for me. I love, as you can maybe tell a little bit, as you can maybe tell a little bit, I love black and silver and a pretty blue color. I mean, I wish you could see, I'll have to do a decor tour, I guess. We have a white tree. Like, I just really like those kind of color schemes are really awesome to me. So I did pick this up. And I thought that this was a pretty cute ornament. It's pretty heavy. It is kind of well made. I mean, there's little hot glue hanging off of it but it's it's fairly well made in my opinion I'll let it focus and it was 50% off ornaments I should have got like a hundred more but you know this was four dollars and to be honest with you I don't know that I'd pay four dollars for it I probably should have got two but um it's 50% off so I got it for two one ninety nine so that was really awesome because this is such a cute ornament to me. And I might just hang it either in my car or like on my lamp or something. 
I just thought it was festive. I don't necessarily have a tree and I'm not sure it'll fit with our theme of our tree. Even though our tree is white, it's a whole story. I'll go into it. I'll do a decor tour, but um, it's really all I got. And I think I'm actually done with all of my holiday shopping. Probably. I don't know. I'm going out tomorrow to, to get some tissue paper and stuff and I'm sure I'll see something. So wish me luck. Um, I hope you all have some luck with your holiday shopping and that everything's done and everything comes in on time because you know that's crazy. But um, I'll see you guys later and bye. <laughs>